Soapy is in his room watching his regular show. When all of a sudden, he realizes he's out of beer. Soapy must go to the store to stock up on more beer. Soapy is on his way to the market. With his dog. Soapy's dog isn't very bright. He spends the majority of his time on his face. Soapy and the dog arrive at the market. I want some beer. Well, Soapy, it just so happens we had a brand come in today. Fresh off the market. What's your fancy? I would like the mountain rock. <laughs> it tickles my stomach so. That'll be five dollars. Uh, here's the money, good sir. And don't worry, Soapy doesn't deal in dirty money. <laughs> hey, Soapy, I thought I told you to stay out of our side of town. This is the dirty street, see? And that's my beer that you're paying for. Yeah, so cough it up, Soapy. We're not playing around. If you think you're gonna clean me out, you're sadly mistaken. I think it's time Soapy cleaned your clock. Right in the fucking eye! You killed my friend, Soapy. You're gonna pay. Fuck you. You'll never defeat me. How's about a spin cycle? Ah, get off me! Damn you, Soapy! Then, Soapy saw something at the corner of his eye. It appeared that his dog had been struck down in the midst of his epic battle. Whatever shall he do? Soap dog, I will avenge thee! Well, Soapy, <laughs> looks like you got this far. Just figured me out, huh? Hey, that's right, I'm a mad scientist. I'm gonna harvest your dog's body parts for... Research of some sort that's kind of crazy and kooky, you know? I'm gonna harvest that balancing part of his head so that I can use it in my line of segways that I plan to engineer. <laughs> I'll never let you get away with this. Ha ha ha, you will never defeat me. Let me know when. Oh, huh, Soapy, I'm invincible now. I have reached my final stage, and there's not a damn thing you can do to kill me. Yeah, baby. Soapy found his weak spot. His testicles. On the next episode of Soapy. <laughs> I'm gonna make it. No, I have to believe in myself. There he is! Shut him in! Shut him in! I'm 11! It's a hero kid! I'm 11! I'm 11! Oh my gosh! He's up there! You're my father! Your mother walked out when I was like, uh, kinda, you know, doing some things, so, uh, you know, that's why I never was around, but uh, I'm ready to be your dad now. Mazel tov!